At night time, reality becomes somewhat different. It suddenly gets a certain sense of strangeness to what it would have during the daytime. My name is Rachel Louise Brown and I'm a, an artist um, that primarily uses photography to capture the things that I am interested in. My residency at the Palm Beach Photographic Center has been going for four years now. The name of the show is Simulations. I came to Florida and I applied for the residency because I was really interested in how Florida is advertised to Europe and the United Kingdom as being a place of entertainment and escapism and a sort of kind of thrill-seeking place for people that want to escape reality. Throughout my um, career as an artist, I, since leaving education, since leaving my masters, I have consistently done residencies because they've given me the space to explore something that's unfamiliar to me. The residency gives me an access to a place and to locals that I wouldn't get if I just kind of turned up with my camera. The first year I did my usual process which is wandering around at night time with my big medium format film camera. So I have a process of doing that to kind of get to grips with the place. I always do a self-portrait where you wouldn't know it was me but I become a character within the space. I went to the Breakers Hotel and they allowed me to shoot in two of their ballrooms and I run out into the space and I just dance or I play. So what you get, because it's a long exposure, is this ghostly figure moving through the space and there's one in particular that really worked well. Within the show there was the gymnasts and the, and the marching bands and the ballerinas, which was a sort of kind of detour from where I began with the nighttime explorations but when you go to the show and you walk around you can see the evolution of the work and it began with these nighttime explorations it then moved on to niche entertainment places and then eventually I thought to myself what about people who actually train to entertain so you know these young teenagers who are spending a lot of time to perform for the, you know, the entertainment of others to become a, vis a visual spectacle. So that's when I started to look at the ballerinas and the marching bands, which we don't have in the UK, because so I've always been quite fascinated with. The uniforms are so beautiful. In a similar way to the simulated environments and the people who performed that responded to the casting call, the ballerinas, the marching bands, they are the kind of end point, I think, where the exploration was about people who actually perform and become a simulated character rather than an environment, so it kind of went full circle. <laughs>